The families of those killed in two identical Boeing crashes face to face with the head of the company appearing before a US congressional inquiry. We are sorry, deeply and truly sorry. I think about you and your loved ones every day and I know our entire Boeing team does as well. Dennis Muhlenberg testified on the first anniversary of a Boeing 737 MAX crash off the coast of Indonesia before another in Ethiopia five months later. 346 lives lost and flaws with technology called MCAS designed to prevent mid-air stalls at fault for both. And the people who are... And some lawmakers accuse Boeing of hiding those flaws. These loved ones never had a chance. They were in flying coffins as a result of Boeing deciding that it was going to conceal MCAS from the pilots. The premise that we would lie or conceal is just not consistent with our values. The 737 MAX remains grounded worldwide, 371 aircraft in total, with no exact date for when regulators will allow them in the air again. Boeing has been accused of cutting corners in a rush to bring the 737 MAX to market as part of a battle with European rival Airbus to dominate smaller passenger jets. But the company denies this and says when the 737 MAX returns to the skies, it will be one of the safest aircraft ever. Owen Fairclough, CGTN, Washington.